Huh? Are you good at Mario Kart? I'm the best at Mario Kart, as you can clearly see. All of them? Every single... Almost all of them. Alright, what up? You already know what's going on. Uh, I got another unboxing for you guys, and it's this Mario Mini Anti-Grab RC Racer. I don't know how many of you guys have seen this before, but they offer this in two sizes and they used to sell these exclusively at Toys R Us. So yeah, I'm just gonna go right into it and unbox it because most of this is just gonna be me playing with it. All right, so let me go ahead and give you guys a quick look at the box. Obviously, this is the front. It shows you the little Mario Racer there. Again, they do offer a larger version of this, but I can't find that anywhere. It's also much more expensive. This one will run you about $45 after tax. Uh, and then on this side, uh, the back, it does show you all the different modes that it has. Uh, it has anti-gravity and race mode. No, this doesn't fly, it's just an RC car. And apparently it does 360 spins, wheelies, and drifts. So I want to check that out. Um, so yeah. And the other side of the box, I don't know if you want to see the bottom. It's got nothing. And then the top just shows that. So, let's go ahead and get this open. All right, so it's finally out of the box. Um, again, it does have like this compartment here that I need to take out. Um, also on the actual car itself. Uh, I'm gonna do that off camera because I have to go find a screwdriver. Uh, but then once that's done, I'll go ahead and install the batteries and set this up. Um, this, this controller feels honestly pretty cheap. I feel like if I were to drop this, it would just disintegrate. The car feels pretty pretty high quality though. Like this has so much heft to it and just like a piece of paper is heavier than this. So yeah, let me go ahead and get that done and then we'll go ahead and swap the batteries. Alright, so that was a pain. It had batteries in there. I thought the batteries were in the controller because it does have a port back here. As you saw before, it has this cable for the try me mode. Um, and it just goes on the bottom of the, of the racer car. I thought the batteries would have been in the remote, but they're actually in there. So all I had to do really was put batteries in here. So let's go ahead, I already turned that on. Let's turn this on um, and try it out. I'm gonna move the controller off camera. I'm just gonna test it out really fast here. Otherwise, let's go to the park and check it out. Oh, so that's just in it, it's an anti-grab mode. The 
drifting kind of sucks, if I'm being honest. Alright, enough of that. Let me go show you guys this at the park. batteries are dying obviously this wasn't designed to be used outdoors and i assume you know it's not supposed to be used for very long periods of time i've already been filming for about 45 minutes um my park is not crazy big but it's big enough so i'm gonna see we're just gonna follow it around and see if it dies if not then i've got some good footage of it going through the park <laughs>
lasted quite a long time. In fact, I'm almost back at the house and he's, he's good. So yeah, that was that. Um, let me know if you guys like me doing these toy unboxings. Who knows, I might do more. I do buy a lot of toys. That was one um, that I've wanted for a while. As I mentioned before, they do offer a larger size of it, but I can't find it anywhere. I guess it's online exclusive at this point. But yeah, see you guys next time.